and then they could create a borrow or often option trade, uh, they would borrow and lend the share they had created. That was yeah. in the evidence done. So it, it, can you explain it in a very simple way? How do you do conversion trades? Because it, what, it's what happens in all the cases now. We, you learned it, that. It's in all it, the it, cases. It, yeah, it pretty much is in all the cases. And, and, and actually, they, they call it exactly what the email said, synthetic shares. So in its simplest form, what it is, is imagine there's two members to the conspiracy. One goes out and buys a, a big put contract, let's say a 50,000 shares in the aggregate. Explain to people what a put contract is. So, so, so basically a put contract is where you think the stock is going to go down. You, you think it's going to decrease in price. And so you are going to, let's say you think it's going to go down to uh, uh, $40 a share and you'll buy 50,000 shares, but it, it's for a specific time period. So your, your put contract is betting that the stock's going to go down. The call is the opposite of that. You think it's going to go up. You then go and uh, purchase that contract, uh, the, the, the same contract with the same date, with the same amount of stock. And then ultimately, if you take a put with a call, now you have two ends of the pipe and you put the pipe together, you've got a piece of pipe. In this case, you've got a synthetic share. So ultimately you can go to the option market, assuming the issuer has options, and then you're able to uh, create that synthetic share. Now, what, why is it important? Why? Because you can show it to the compliance department to show, look, I have these shares. Let me short, let me do whatever I want. But what happens is, is a day or two before the contract matures, because every option contract has a maturity date, that group of perpetrators says, oh, no, we're going to just tear the contract up until their compliance department comes knocking again and says, oh, you don't have any shares to cover this. Where are the shares? Oh, we have this synthetic share that we created with uh, Goldman and Merrill, and so therefore, uh, ultimately, we, uh, you know, we're okay. We're in compliance. It is just another scheme of where something fake is created. The the amount of fake things that are created, the amount of counterfeit things that are created in this scheme is endless. Whether it's fake lending, fake options, fake sales, down the list, it's all fake. Except now, for the let me ask you a lot. 